What's up guys, Matt here. I'm here today with my Golf R. I just wanted to point something out, show it to you, something that I experienced that I want to just uh, pass on to you to make sure that uh, you don't freak out when you see this. So check this out. Going into the oil fill cap, turn it over. I'm gonna set this down so I can grab a light so you can see this better. So as you can see, you've got this milky tan yellowish gunk under the fill cap and then up in the top underneath the fill cap. So immediately, I think, well, I have coolant mixing with my oil. When you have moisture or coolant or water mixing with uh, oil, that's what happens and that is not a good thing. So immediately I'm thinking, blown head gasket, I've got coolant mixing it with my oil, I'm screwed. Well, I started researching it and there's basically two ideas out there. First, your head gasket's blown and you're screwed. Secondly, it's a combination of driving short distances and driving in the cold. Both of those criteria fit my driving habits, at least during the week. It's uh, Wisconsin, it's below 30 every day. I'm driving about eight minutes to work, eight minutes home. What happens is that because it's so cold, as the motor heats up, as the oil heats up, you have condensation that rises to the top, mixes with that oil, and you get some of those deposits up in the top of the engine. Now. That still doesn't sound very good. You have all of that sludge in your engine. Well, I have a buddy that's a Audi Volkswagen mechanic and I asked him the question, is this gonna hurt my engine? Is this sludge up in the top underneath this cap, is that gonna affect the performance of the engine or is it gonna actually hurt the engine? Well, the short answer is no. He has seen Volkswagen engines that have the whole fill cap plumb full of this stuff and you scoop it out and the engine was perfectly fine. That being said, he did recommend that I take the car out every few days for a, a high heat run, drive it, get all, everything up to temperature, drive it hard, get all of that moisture out and then I will avoid this issue. But as long as it's just the, the moisture buildup because of the cold weather and the short driving, it's not really a big deal. So I hope this video helped you. I hope it gave you a little bit of peace of mind. If you liked the video, give it a like. If you like more content, subscribe to the YouTube channel and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed it. hope you got some information out of it, and I'll see you next time.